let's look at part B one the speed time graph below shows information on the first 60 seconds of a car's journey okay calculate the acceleration in meters per second squared of the car during stage B all right so let's look at what's happening here this is time this is speed time is going by this means it was at rest it was moving and then as time goes by you press on the accelerator and it goes faster and faster and faster it was going at this meters per second then at 5 then 10 seconds it was going faster 15 seconds faster 20 seconds even faster so it keeps accelerating but at 40 seconds now seem as if the driver press harder on the gas pedal and the accelerator and increase even faster now they say calculate the acceleration in meters per second squared remember acceleration means a change in the speed All right a change in the speed of the car if the line was like this the car would be moving but it would be going at constant speed the acceleration would be zero now since the lines are slant upward from left to right the car is going faster and faster if the car was going slowing down it would be like this right all right the acceleration of the car during stage b this is stage b no the acceleration is meters per second squared what it really means is meters per second per second that means it multiplied by one over second again so up top meter times one is meter the only bottom second times second is second squared so it's meters per second squared now what is the acceleration here you have a change in speed of 5, 10, 15 so the change in speed is uh, the high speed is 40 40 minus 15 that's the change in speed over the change in time 60 minus 40 60 minus 40 so the acceleration is a change in speed over time no is the same as the gradient of the line it's a gradient of this line rise over run the change in speed is the rise 40 minus 15 it rises from 15 to 40 so that change is the rise and then the change in time horizontally is the run all right so 40 minus 15 that's what 40 minus 10 is 30 minus 5 more that's 25 over 60 minus 40 so that's 20 25 over 20 5 to 25 5 and 5 to 24 so that's 5 over 4 it is 1 point it's 1 and 1 quarter 1.25 so it's 1 the acceleration a is 1.25 25 meters per second squared or right, since they put it my my what's this since they put it as m s to the negative one so let's write that way m s to the negative one that come from indices where you have oh they have m s to the negative one that's meters per second but it's squared now so it's now ms to the negative two to the negative two right that's from your indices one over s squared is the same as s to the negative two if you remember that all right so acceleration during stage b is 1.25 meters per second squared 